Hola people, welcome back to ITEC Prophecy. This is Shreya and I am back with a new video of Hire Me Lab walkthrough in Cyber Defenders. So let's get started. So first of all let's see the challenge details. <clears throat> so Karan is a security professional looking for a new job. A company called Taoshi offered her a position and asked her to complete a couple of tasks to provide her technical competency. Analyze the provided disk image and answer the questions based on her understanding of the cases she was assigned to investigate. Great. So let's dive into the questions. Okay, so the first, oh, before that, uh, you have to follow the same instruction. You have to download the challenge from here. This is the unzipping password. And I have already downloaded it. So let's open the image in FTK image. Add evidence item, image file, next. Okay, so this is the path. Open. Great. Okay. <coughs> so, what is the administrator's username? Okay, let's go to partition 2, root, users. Yeah, it's current, K A R E N. Correct. What is the OS build number? Okay. So the OS build number must be in the as this is a registry analysis of Windows, so the OS build number must be in the software registry. So we need to export the software registry. Yeah. Export file. Let's export it in desktop. Great. <coughs> okay, so it's exported. Now I'll open it in registry viewer. Okay, so let's dive into Microsoft Windows NT. This is the default path which I'm using. Yeah. Current version. And yeah, the build number is one six two nine nine. So one six two nine nine. Cool. What is the host name of the computer? <coughs> so, host name of the computer. So that that must be stored in the system registry. So let's export the system registry. Okay, <coughs> let's open it again in registry viewer. Great. Okay. So yeah. So in control, set zero zero one. Then control and computer name must be J. Yeah. Computer name. Great. It's totally not. Totally not a hack. So <clears throat> next is a messaging application was used to communicate with a fellow alpaca enthusiast. What is the name of the software? Okay, so this is clearly indicated that it must be in the software registry. So let's open it again. Okay, the default path of uh, applications. Okay, 
so <coughs> software microsoft windows current version app files okay so let me open the software yes then dive into microsoft okay then windows windows yep windows current version current version um and app parts update and it is a messaging application so you have to guess the type of application that can be used for messaging so chrome excel no license mp player powershell setup.exe yeah so you can see that skype server.exe is present here so yeah so it must be the application skype let's try great okay so the next question is what is the zip code of the administrator's post okay so it must be saved somewhere in the information of web data Okay, so let's see if there is something called web data. Okay, so this is unreadable. Let's see the text form if we can extract something. So, this is the email. Okay, so we can see a code, a zip code is there. So, let me try this out. Great. Okay, <coughs> so what are the initials of a person who contacted the admin user from Taoship? So, in order to contact someone, we normally use email. Official banner. Let's see. Outlook. Great. Okay. So, let me see. Here we can see an OST file, but uh, it cannot be read normally. So we need a OST viewer for this. Okay. Okay. So you can use the kernel OST viewer. Let's open this. Okay, so okay, initials of the person who contacted the admin user from Kaushi. Box. Okay, so we can see it may be MS. Let's try. Great. <coughs> okay. So, how much money was Taoshi willing to pay upfront? So, okay. So, it's one five zero. Great. Okay. What country is the admin user meeting the hacker group in? Okay. Okay. What we need is to do can is trust. Hack this machine will give you more information. Meet us here. So here it's a degree given latitude and longitude. Let's see in Google if we get a place. 
so I think this place Okay, so it's Egypt. Let's copy this and paste this. Great. So, what is the machine's time zone? Okay. So, let's see <coughs> the machine information, time zone, and everything is stored in the system registry by default. So, let's see. Go to the control set one control and there must be a time zone information okay okay so it's utc let's see utc great okay when was alpha4.docs last accessed okay so <coughs> Let's see. Let's look into the partition three. Okay. So the date is three seventeen. 2019 the time is 9:52 pm and correct okay so <coughs> there was a second partition on the drive what is the letter assigned to it okay so let's see in the system registry about the partition so what we have here is partition 2 and partition partition 3 so except th these two, we can have a partition where mounted devices are uh, stored. So let's see. Okay. Yeah, mounted devices. And yeah, so the partition is A because D and C is already present there. So the answer must be a yep okay so what is the answer to the question company's manager asked karan okay okay so let me open this mail and sort this okay so Okay, so as you can see here, the answer is the card cries no more. Let me copy this. Submit. Great. Okay. What is the job position offered to current? Job position. <coughs> it must be here. Okay. So cyber security analyst. Great. Okay, the next question. When was the admin user password last changed? Okay, so all the information regarding passwords are stored in the SAM registry by default. So let's export the SAM registry now. Let's go to root, user uh, windows, system32 config, and SAM. Export files, desktop. So let me open this in registry viewer. So, okay. so let me go to the account section and users. So we want the last password change by the administrator. So here the administrator is current. And the type is uh, 03E9. So let me go to the this particular folder and go to last password change section, which is in the bottom left. So here we can see 213019 19, Great. So let me type it out. 03 
Great. The next question is what version of Chrome is installed on the machine? Okay. Let's open FTK again and let's see. In the update section. Okay. There must be a version folder. Yeah. So the last version is this one. So copy this, paste here. Cool. So, what is the host URL of Skype? Okay. Let me open the FTP. Uh, let me see the Skype. Okay, so here is the host URL you can see. Copy and paste. Great. The next question What is the domain name of the website current browsed on Alpaca Care that the file alpaca care.docs is based on? Okay, this is an interesting question. So in a previous question, we saw the alpaca docs somewhere here in the root folder, root directory. Let's go. Let's find that. Yeah. So let me extract this. Let's stop. Let me open this. So there must be a domain here. Okay. I guess so. This one. Palmoni. Palomino Alpaca Farm. Let me copy this and try it out. If it's correct or not. Remove the spaces. dot com enter awesome so we successfully completed the lab file and let me know in the comment section that which lab do you want to be solved next in cyber defenders lab by then goodbye take care and have fun bye see you in the next video